All right, here is the progress. Yesterday turned into a uh, kind of an errand day. So did half of today. Turned into me returning about 80 items to all of my favorite hardware stores. By the way, my favorite hardware store so far is Ace. Ace is definitely the place. So today, got a late start. I got a late start. These guys were here helping me out already. So thank you, Mojo Bus, for all your hard work and help. So they've both been working on these things today. And today's going to be Toe Kick Install Day. I'm not really sure how to install a toe kick, but I think I have an idea. So we're going to see how that happens today. We'll get a brief instruction from uh, Justin, Mojo Bus. By the way, this hardware is awesome. Look at that, you see that? It like goes into a locking position, and then unlock position, self-closing drawers, locked, nothing's gonna fly out. We're also doing the same thing for the fridge drawer. I don't know if it's gonna hold it. I hope it will, but it will be, <laughs> it'll be pretty heavy, and I'm not sure these things can withstand the weight. I put yet another layer of paint on here and it looks fantastic. I also did the back bumper and I painted over this little yellow, or sorry not yellow, this black piece of, uh, I don't know, rubber. So everything is nice and painted yet again. We have Mojo Bus in his natural habitat here. <laughs> you want to run through what you've been doing today? Absolutely. Um, I don't remember where I started today, <laughs> but we have these nice locking latches that we installed. Yep. So when they're closed, buttons in, they don't open. Mm -hmm. We installed new knobs. Matching knobs. I took one of these to Lowe's and they had this very similar kind of, you know, shape and metal. And some little locking mechanisms for the cabinets. So when it's loaded, it's not going anywhere. You gotta really nice. put some force on there to open it. Nice. Um, yeah, we just got all the drawer fronts. We're leveling them all out, making sure all the uh, gaps are even. Looks nice and smooth. Mm -hmm. And the last thing is this big old drawer front here that I'm trying to level out and get even where the fridge is gonna go. Nice. So these are uh, 500 pound slides and uh, we <laughs> measured someone's fridge uh, assuming that you know I would get the same uh, fridge and all that hopefully we are right on our measurements because uh, uh, that's all we have to work with <laughs> so something has to go inside so if, if we're off I got to get a smaller fridge we don't want that nah, nah. <laughs> today is uh, Mojo Bus's last day with me uh, we did talk about finishing up these things Renee's outside helping to sand paint and prep uh, the couches, the benches, but as you can see, there's a whole ton of wiring, which I still need to do next up on my agenda after these guys take off, uh, is to work on the solar, the electrical. Uh, I have been working on the horn in the past few days. I got some Bondo. I primed it yesterday, and then I just hit it with Elastomeric today, and then I'll install the horn. Got a new horn. Anyways, you'll see the horn in uh, the next video, I think. All right, we're gonna show you guys what uh, what we've been doing. Well, by me, I mean Justin. So, right now we're putting in the uh, this bad boy, the push to lock. And so, <laughs> we're trying not to make the mistake we did yesterday. We're still gonna have to put wood on the back. Sorry. What's that? So we're still gonna have to put a block of wood on the back. So yeah. Blow it out. yeah. Okay. So, I just go ahead and do that yeah, we used a spade bit yesterday and kind of blew out some of these things because this has a chop, 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 like a helicopter. And it, it kind of damaged some of the wood. But um, today, we are learning <laughs> from mistakes. <laughs> Try not to make the same. Here, let me give you a hand. Cool. All right, 
right, so what we're doing is uh, drilling holes for this part to get pushed in. And then uh, on the other side, it goes into the, into the wood and then screwed in. In a minute. And then how these things work is you push it and then it goes up. saw would be ideal for these but uh, True, yeah. okay. we didn't have the little pilot so we ended up using are, are here try this same? one that's 15 16 so trying to gradually <laughs> make a hole but when you have that much to cut through I we just doubled it we just went from like half inch to an inch basically from the other side, if you want. Are we through? No, nope. almost. That's good, right? Yeah. Cool. Cool, we didn't blow out that corner. Let's see if it, uh... Let me clean it out real quick. <laughs> So this part is supposed to, uh, yeah, we do have one inch here. Oh, we do? Mm-hmm. Yeah, we'll clean that. <laughs> oh. oh, barely. Come on, baby. So that should be the perfect size for that to slide in. It's nice and snug right now. So, all right. So that's basically what we're doing here: measure and then we put that little thing in. And thank, thank God, like unlike yesterday. So we'll do uh, the second one, just like we did the first. All right, we got Mojo Bus over here and myself, and we just put in the final touches over here on the fridge. What are we calling this thing? Like a fridge box? fridge slide yeah. so push button push those and then boom you open it up and then that's where the fridge is gonna live so you will not be able to see the fridge and hopefully these things don't break I tried to get all metal ones but that doesn't really exist <laughs> so we got metal and plastic and uh, yeah and thanks to Mojo Bus if anybody needs some custom cabinetry where can they get a hold of you uh, go to my website, mojo-bus.com, yep. and you can contact me from there. Hell yeah. And uh, he's also doing, he's also a graphic artist. He's a, a, a jack of all trades. So he does gra <laughs> graphic art, uh, logos, uh, websites, all kinds of stuff. So I'm sure he will give you a very friendly price. And uh, if you guys want cabinets for your uh, school bus, van, or home, hit him up, mojobus.com. Mojo-bus.com. <laughs> Here is what it will kind of look like, minus the wires, and then add some cushions in the front. But we just put the freshly painted couch bench pieces in. We're going to have to cut off, I think, about a half inch on both sides. So we have a little bit more room to, uh, you know, to slide. But wow, look at how nice this looks. Holy moly. Oh, yeah, I could get used to this. <laughs> Plenty deep as you can see but it will change because we will have some cushions here but this is looking pretty badass and I really like the, the cream color that we went with this side you get a better idea of how pretty it will be with the uh, the shaker on the bottom part and then of course the pull out slide out chest table dining table 
I think we'll be under, shoot, maybe this one I'm sitting under. But anyways, it is coming together. This gives me great hope, thanks to Mojo Bus for uh, helping out, but this gives me incredible hope that I will be done sooner rather than later. I still need to do the solar. I know, I know, I know, I know. I'm gonna work on it next week, I promise. Mm -hmm.